Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. You probably have a website. You probably have more than one website. And the thing you got to keep in mind in terms of websites is, that, well, they got to be up. They have to be running. And when they're running, uh, they have to run fast. Do you realize that if Amazon is possibly microseconds slower, they actually lose revenue? Site speed is so important. Just because you have a website that's running doesn't mean that it's fully optimized. Now, many of you out there have chosen WordPress to download on your own or to install through a web host. I'm talking about WordPress.org, not WordPress.com. They're two completely separate entities. You can get a free blog on WordPress.com. You can host your blog there, but a lot of people choose to register their own domain on their own web host and download the code and, and go at it on their own. So in terms of performance, let me just give you a story. Uh, I did some research just this past weekend to recognize that Google's Webmaster Tools, which is free, by the way, I'd recommend everybody who has a website to use Google's Webmaster Tools. They give you tons of tips and tricks on how to optimize performance, and, and it tells you exactly how Google's seeing your site. And it told me uh, under one section that on average, it took nine seconds to load LockerGnome.com. And Chris.Perillo.com was almost just as slow. Why did you guys not tell me this? Why didn't you say, Chris, your website's loading slow? I would have answered. I would have said, what? Chris at Perillo.com. Always drop me a line or tweet me or tell me something's wrong because I may not see it. So I looked at it. I'm like, this is crazy. We have the W3 Total Cache plugin installed, which, by the way, is the definitive WordPress plugin that you can download right now to install to make your WordPress website run faster. But just because you install it doesn't mean that it's fully optimized. I didn't realize this. I knew we had it installed. I thought it was done. We had someone configure it so that we were working just fine, or so I thought. So uh, Creighton Miller, who is a, one of our nomies, uh, is also someone who loves WordPress. And he recorded a screencast this past weekend that we uploaded to nomies.com, the link is in the description, uh, showing WordPress users how to better optimize W3 Total Cache to make your site load faster. I think we all want this. This is the thing. If you serve up ads on your website, you want your site to load faster. Uh, so he looked at something and saw that we were caching something incorrectly. And instantaneously, almost just like that, LockerGnome.com went from a nine-second load time to two to three seconds massive speed increase. I couldn't believe it. If you've looked at LockerGnome.com at any point over the past several months or year, it should be loading faster today than it ever has before. And if it doesn't, I would be shocked. Website performance is so important. It's a metric by which Google looks at your website and tells it whether, well, it's loading too slow. It's not, it's not going to be working well enough for our visitors because they're all about sending quality visitors to your website or making sure that it's quality on the other end. So website speed could very well be a factor in your website's rankings on Google or Bing or whatever other search engine you might use like DuckDuckGo.com. If you haven't used that before, check it out. Look at your site speed. Uh, in, in fact, Creighton recommended a couple of other, I think it was, uh, was it Pingdom, I think, .com to better look at where your site might be slowing down. Uh, you owe it to yourself to make sure that site is loading fast. Tying it into a CDN or a content delivery network is so important. Download the free plugin, W3 Total Cache, install it, and then watch the screencast. It is for nomies, but again, I got to tell you, if you're online and you're doing business online and you want that website to load fast... Uh, you owe it to yourself to look into it. I had no idea it was as bad as it was, but I'm very grateful that Creighton did this uh, and really helped improve, I would say, your user experience on LockerGnome.com or Chris.Perillo.com, and I wanted to let you know that information is currently available for you to look at. You can find the information anywhere else, too. Uh, I, I would certainly, uh, you know, I've given you a lead on the plugin, given you a lead on realizing you have to look at your website's performance, uh, and hopefully you don't mind the information, uh, you know, because I know a lot of people, as I said, have websites.